The IYT Master of Yachts 200 Gross Tonnage Limited course is a professional certification program designed for individuals who want to become qualified to operate yachts of up to 200 gross tons in size. The course is offered by the International Yacht Training Organization and is recognized worldwide as a standard of excellence in yacht training. Yes, and you are to the right, the primary one, you are traveling to the Moy 200 GT Limited course covers a wide range of topics related to yacht operation, including navigation, vessel handling, safety procedures, engine maintenance, and emergency response. The course is conducted over a period of several days and includes both classroom instruction and practical hands-on training. Practical exam is designed to test the student's ability to safely operate a yacht of up to 200 gross tons in size. The exam is conducted by an IYT appointed examiner and typically takes place aboard a yacht, with the student assuming the role of captain. So, you will be the first captain, you are the bearing man, uh, you will be uh, uh, in front. The examiner may ask you to plot a course or navigate through a set of waypoints, using both electronic and manual navigation techniques. And after you plot this, then you can fix your position. I will tell you, okay guys, you bring your decision. You have to plot your course. The examiner may ask you to demonstrate your ability to maneuver the yacht in various conditions, including docking, anchoring, and mooring. You may also be asked to demonstrate your ability to handle the yacht in adverse weather conditions. The course is designed to be comprehensive and challenging, and students are expected to have a strong background in yachting and or navigation before enrolling. A hand compass bearing is a navigational tool used to determine the direction of a distant object, such as a navigational aid or landmark. It involves using a handheld compass to take a bearing, which is the direction from the observer's location to the object in question. Students will learn about communication procedures and equipment used in the maritime industry, including VHF radios, satellite phones, and EPROs. The examiner may ask you to demonstrate your knowledge of safety procedures and emergency response including man overboard drills, fire prevention and fighting, and abandoning ship. The practical exam is typically conducted over several hours and can be physically and mentally demanding. It's important to come prepared, well rested, and with a positive attitude. Remember to listen carefully to the examiner's instructions and communicate clearly with your crew during the exam.